All right, listen, I got a schedule to keep. I'm going to keep moving. Requests are disabled today. This is by design, guys. I have, like I said, I've got a very specific list of ships that I have to play and give out and all the rest of this stuff. So we're going into game one. Ginger's going to start a giveaway here in a minute. That's going to tick for a bit. And then we're going to play this game. And then when the game's over, we're going to give away Repulse. That game was insane, Gabe. That game was insane. That game that game in Warspite started insane because of the matchmaking. The matchmaking was lunacy. I have never seen matchmaking that bad. And it was at tier six, right? Three submarines, three destroyers, two carriers on each team. And I'm in a battleship. And I remember, I, I went back and watched that game this week to clip it out of the channel. And I remember thinking, I remember looking at this going, what the hell am I going to do? This is ridiculous. Um, so, so yeah, uh, that was totally a thing that occurred. And a half, yes, fine, Gabe, and a half. But your half would have been more believer, if, believable if you'd ever actually landed a torpedo on me. <laughs> Which you never did. You did kill our carrier, though, because he was apparently not very good. All right, we're top tier in Repulse. This is a bit surprising. I would not have expected this. But there are two submarines. Not a big fan of that. We'll see how this goes. You know, one of the other things that that game reminded me of that I had forgotten was just how maneuverable War Spite really is. Like, when you put the rudder over on that sh in that ship, she turns, right? She turns over, she goes. It's, it's a surprise. You get so used to mid-tier battleships handling like crap. America. That ship doesn't handle like crap. That was nice. That was nice to see. Who was that talking in chat? The Ismail. That's fine. I love how he says, too many battleships spawned east. I'm going to go west. So now we have three battleships going. Whatever. We'll figure it out. Yeah, Armored, it's been, I've been surprised. And, and, and Warspite's bone, Warspite has two things going for her. One, she's a very compact hull. It's a very short overall length. So the rudder shift time is good. But then once she starts to make the turn, she makes it in a very short distance. Um, I don't know the numbers off the top of my head, but I'm willing to bet you her turning circle is is pretty good for tier six. Sub 600 meters. I don't know. Let me. You know what? I think. Do I have my spreadsheet up? I had my spreadsheet up last night doing videos. Let's have a peek. Yeah, here I can filter it. Clear. Filter by. Filter by value. Turn off ten. Turn on six. What does War Spite say? War Spite. War Spite, 550. Yes, yes. War Spite does have the best turning circle in Tier 6. So there you go. There you go. Things things you learned today, ladies and gentlemen. We're all learning together. Hmm. So, in Omaha, a QE and I go up the two line. And the, the punchline of that joke is not shenanigans ensue. Because I got I got a real bad feeling about this. Yeah, this G ginger right now it feels like a joke. Ooh ooh hi. <laughs> da, na, 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 na. Oh, he sped up. I didn't lead him quite enough because he turned his engines on. Feels bad. It's all right. We'll take a shot at him here again in a minute. Yeet the Warship. I love the name. Spotter airborne. Those shells got an in-flight meal. And still hit nothing. Feels bad. Yeah, gonna have to turn here. I'm behind a West Virginia? My God, these shells are slow. Oh my God. What in the hell just happened? Okay, I have to I have to way over lead things from what I expect what I'm expecting.
Although I would have a pretty, looks like I got a pretty decent shot on this Fuso over here. Let's get the gun slipped. Oh look guys, the sub is here. Aren't one of the subs. Aren't we excited by that? I know I'm excited to see a submarine in this game. So, Ginger, did you get that giveaway running for game one? Okay. No, don't wait on me. When the game when the game starts, when you're happy a couple of minutes in, just start her up. Don't wait on me. There we go. All right, guys. First giveaway of the game of the day is up and running. Get in there and get you some free stuff. You did. You crazy son of a bitch. You did. Haha, <laughs> Laser. Thank you for the resub. Oh, and by the way, um, oh, he grounded himself. What was I gonna say there? Oh yeah, the bot, uh, the bot, this bot spam is turned off. The bot will not acknowledge your entries today. So, that's intentional, but trust me, your entries are being cataloged. Well, we're up two ships. But right now, this doesn't feel all that good because I'm up against three battleships back here. Who was that? Hatman with the bits. Thank you much. Really? I love... I'm a huge fan of how... Of how they can all hit me and I can't hit them in return because the Byron has better dispersion than I do all of a sudden. Come on, Fujin. Eat some torpedoes. Oh, my God. Fujin. Super dishonor brew, sir. The Fujin just got torpedoed by an Omaha. Very dishonor brew. TC with the raid already. Welcome in. How you doing? Well, if I had torpedoes, I might be inclined to go push these guys and get a, do a little brawling, but I kind of don't right now. Um, I'm lit. I'm trying to think how I'm lit. The Visby possibly? I don't know. Oh, it's the submarine. The submarine's probably chasing me. Um... Yeah, see, there he is. It's fine. He's going to lose sight of me here in a moment. We're going to get the guns flipped back to port. And then I'm going to go right around this island and get in his face. He's about 10 kilometers off. And his torpedoes shouldn't be able to make that turn around the island, even if he launched them beforehand. Gucci, Gucci. Oh, look at that. I lied. Gucci, Gucci. <laughs> they don't have the range, though. All right. Time to back off, then. We're going to keep moving. We had a huge... We had a three-ship lead. Now it's only a two-ship lead, and I don't want to deal with this, this stupid sub. Isla with the follow. Welcome in. Yes. Fujin very dishonorable. All right, let's just keep moving. The one fun thing here is that I am quite a bit faster than this submarine. So, like, there's not much he can do about it. Between speed boost and swift, I am quite a bit faster than the sub. He's in a stern chase, which means he's not going to be all that useful. Let's see if we can burn this Byron down. Oh, and it got such good gas mileage. Edge with the resub. Welcome in. How you doing, Edge? Our team has taken the lead. 
All right, you're stuck with that fire, Mr. Byron. Look at that! I got a flood on the sub! Woohoo! Go me and stuff. Well, the last four surviving ships they have are basically right here. Really want to kill this Byron. I need this sub to ping somebody again so I can kill him. Byron's going out. Yes, there it was. All right. Let's get the AP in the barrel. Sub is behind this island over here, so I sort of don't care about him because he's just not that useful right now. He certainly ha he can have eyes on the Ismail, but he can't do anything about me. I did be a little frosty. This war spite can do mean things to me, but he's firing the HE, so I sort of don't care right now. Oh hi. Now this is a force to be reckoned with. <laughs> hey look, another flood. <laughs> uh, Suck it. Better. Come on, shells. Beat up the war spite. I'm still not leading you correctly. Man, even at this range, these shells these shells uh, don't hit like, the, like I want them to. I mean, fair, castle, but don't expect me to be happy about it. Our victory is in sight. <laughs> I think I'm going to... I think I'm finally going to get the lead right. Here we go. That should be a good sell, though. There we go. He felt that in the morning. There we go. All right. That just leaves the sub and the Weavy. Let's go back for some more fun and games. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm playing a British battleship, and in this game, I have two fires and two floods. I just thought I'd point that out. Oh, my God. I can't even hit the Weavy. It's a West Virginia, and I can't even hit him. Ugh. I'd forgotten how how, dra how much drag these shells had. It's really irritating, honestly. <laughs> Gotta keep over-leading this guy. Now, accepting this engagement is really not intelligent, right? This guy has 16-inch guns, and I don't. So, this is not the smartest thing I could be doing with my time. And I don't have torpedoes, so close. I get no benefit from closing with him. Other than exploiting his really terrible aim and dispersion. Let's see if I can get some full pins here. Seven with the resub! What is up? Oh, I wanted the kill. I wanted this kill. I think the Ismail's about to get him. Yep. And then... And then the sub. Who won't even get to fire? Who won't even get to fire torpedoes again? Oh, Sag. All right, Ginger. Make sure you lock that giveaway up, and then we gotta get a, gotta get a give, game for repul uh, giveaway for repulse going here. Not a terrible game. I you know I quite like repulse. Oh, Nevni had a monster game. Take one of these. Look at this. Wow, shocking. Look at that. What was the question? <laughs> 